I'm just um, like doing a little bit a random video, but uh, I want to say that in my life right now, I'm kind of letting go of a lot of things, dropping a lot of stuff, a lot of clutter. So mental clutter, but not only also, I, and I said it a lot, like a lot of uh, habits that I have. And I'm, my goal is basically to have nothing to do anymore during my day, no shitty routines, nothing, in order to have more space and time to listen to myself and to listen to what I really want. And I also want to say something. Like there's, no, there's something that gives us energy that sustains this reality or consciousness or like what's happening right now there's something that is making it happen at every second and uh, so i don't know if this is true this is just what i believe but i think that that thing is kind of like god but we're part of it so there's just one giant thing that makes all of this happen and my belief is that for everything that doesn't work in uh, our lives I think it's because what we are trying to do is we are trying to manipulate reality in order to reach our selfish goals, our goals, let's say. It's not about being selfish or something. I just said it, but um, I don't know. And I think that whenever you don't trust that things are going to go their way, you know, and that you don't listen also to your own vibe and to your own desires and uh, when you don't face your own fears I feel like the only way reality or God can kind of um, give you a little like uh, uh, tap on the nose to remind yourself that actually everything is fine everything is taken care of is by building up pressure in your life in terms of like your circumstances and uh, yeah, well, just like your circumstances. So basically, life is creating problems for you to realize that you can be happy um, no matter how many problems you have in your life because there is no problem to begin with because there is only abundance and uh, you don't need anything. You don't need a job. You don't need money. You don't need fucking anything because I believe that things are going, they, they can just show up like this, like magic in your life. What if this is all a dream? It's completely staged. And the only reason why everything is like completely random in your life is because you're so scared all the time. Have you ever trusted life 100% and just said, fuck it, I'm going to go travel. I'm selling everything. Uh, I'm just going take that apartment. Even if I don't have the money, I just see maybe like the guy who says the apartment is going to be nice. Like, have you ever tried, even just tried to trust? And I know I haven't. And uh, there's a difference between what we believe and what we know. Do you know that you somehow cannot trust reality? No, you don't fucking know. You just know that uh, there's some stuff that fucks up in your reality when you don't trust it. But you've never, I'm sure you've never had this moment where you really trusted it 100% and everything still went wrong because no one really trusts reality and that's why we're all like these hamsters and we're all just like gathering money saving 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 money and uh like planning everything in our lives and like worrying all the time because we're just worried that everything is going to go bad and i feel like this is why things this is the reason like really uh this is the main reason why i think that everything is going bad in our life and on earth it's because we don't trust we think that something bad is going to happen and we're actually like creating it. And I and that's why in my life I want to just let go of everything and increase the trust. And I don't want to do like for example one video a day on YouTube because that's how you do it. That's how you have success. No, I just want to do what I want and what feels good. So <laughs> So what I want to say is like, also, for example, I had an example in mind the other day and it was illness. For me, illness is reality or God's, uh, God's last 
uh, way to show to you that somehow something is wrong in your thinking and in what you're doing. And I, I perceive this in myself because I have like some health, like small health issues. And because when you have health issues, it's kind of like, it's not like the regular problem that you have in your life because it's the problem that you take with you all the fucking time at every moment. And I think this is to show you, it's like last thing. And if you don't get it, you kind of die because you succumb to your illness. Um, that you have to trust. And um, I think this is just like all a dream. It's all a game. It's all stuff happening in, in consciousness. And everything can change super quick. And... Um, I think the main stuff that we can do is to trust, to have positive thoughts and be aware of our negative thoughts, be more in the present and be more happy just uh, for the sake of being happy. And just like knowing that if this was all a dream and a game, you all of a sudden you'd be so happy. You'd be like, yeah, fuck it. I'm going to quit my job. Tell my boss that he's an asshole. And I'm just going to like take a flight to some awesome place. And maybe like that's the first step and then life responds to you with a lot of things coming your way. And then you have all of a sudden, like you don't have your job anymore, but all of a sudden you're so happy. Now you have all these ideas about what uh, job you could do. And now you're like, oh yes, I can do this, this and that. And then you're, you've got like, <laughs> you go in a hotel room and you start building your online business or whatever, you know, and you, and, and somehow uh, life comes up with like, uh, how do you say with um, discounts on the room price or whatever so that you can continue you have enough money and somehow like everything lines up and that's how long is it seven minutes oh my god and that's how it, I think life is working <laughs> and uh, and that's kind of what I want to experience I want to have the balls to go for my dreams even though I don't know if somehow it's going to like work. So for example, I'd love to just like take an apartment and see if uh, I'll be able to take to pay their like the, the bills. Like right now, I don't think I could, but just like try it out. I, I'm going I'm, I'm maybe going to try it out. I was thinking about this because I believe that uh, we have to increase our trust. Like the only thing that we have it's not nothing material. It's just like our emotions and our like presence and our body. That's it. And uh, everything else can go mayhem. Your family members could die. You could lose everything. You can't even lose your body, basically. Uh, I don't know if this sounds crazy. For some, it might sound super crazy. <laughs> but I'm just saying what I think. Thanks for listening.